Hi everyone, this time I will show you how to crochet such a bunny. You can use for this tutorial any yarn you like and a matching hook. I'm using a 2.5 millimeter hook. And we will start with the magic loop. For this, take your yarn and make a circle. Put the long strand under the circle and pull a long strand through the circle. And you get a loop here. Insert your hook through the loop and then tighten it a little bit. And then chain one to secure. And chain two more. One and two. Now we will continue with double crochets through the circle, through the matching magic ring and for this yarn over. Insert your hook through the ring, grab the yarn, pull up a loop and you have three loops on your hook. And yarn over and pull the yarn through the first two loops. You have two left, yarn over and pull it through the last two. One more time, yarn over, insert your hook through the ring, pull up a loop, you have three loops on your hook, yarn over, pull through two, you have two left, pull through two. And continue doing this until you made 12 double crochets, don't count uh, the chain stitches at the beginning. So these are my 12 double crochets and now we have to pull this short strand. Pull really tight and then you won't see any holes. And to join the circle, insert your hook into the last chain stitch you made at the beginning. And then slip stitch, pull the yarn through all the loops on your hook. And now we'll start with the next round for this chain two or chain three. You can do the bows, chaining two or chaining three. And now we will crochet a double crochet into the same stitch here. And then we'll increase every stitch. That means we will crochet two double crochets into each stitch. So the first and then the second also through the same stitch. And again the first and the second through the same stitch. Yeah, and continue doing this all the way around. Now I made my increases and if you see this, you should know that you should not crochet this stitch. This was a join. And now we will join this round through the third stitch and then slip stitch. Now you can cut your yarn and then pull the yarn through your last loop like this. Then tighten and this is your bunny head. Now we'll continue to crochet the ears.
He should use a different color for the ear. I'm using here a pink one and also the same hook size. First we'll start with a normal slip knot. It's nearly the same as the magic loop, so create your circle. Put a long thread under the circle and pull it through. And you have a loop. Insert your hook and then tighten. This creates your slip knot. Now we have to chain six. Yarn over and pull through. Two, three, four, five, and six. If you want to have larger ears, you should chain more stitches. And it will work the same as I will show you with uh, the six stitches. So now insert your hook into the second stitch from hook. And yarn over and pull through. You have two loops on your hook, yarn over and pull through the two loops. And this creates a single crochet. One more time. Insert your hook into the next stitch, pull through, you have two loops, yarn over and pull through. And this across the row. This is the last one. Now you can cut your yarn and then pull it through the last loop, tighten. Okay. So now we need our first color again. This one. And we insert our hook through the first stitch here. And grab the yarn and pull through and then tie this okay then through the same stitch again Just ignore these, all these short strands. So, and then pull up a loop and chain one. And then continue single crochets in each stitch. Here on the top, we will increase once, we'll crochet two single crochets into this stitch here. So the first and the second. Then continue single crochets. Now insert your hook through the first stitch here again and then slip stitch. Yep, like this. Now we can cut the yarn and pull it through. This is your ear and you can sew it to the hand like this. If you sew the bunny afterwards on some clothes, 
So then you can cut your pink yarn and it is on the back side. But if you want to see the back side later, then you have to sewing your ends into this pink. Uh, yeah, into your work here, into your stitches. And the second year, you will do it the same way. And also, sew it here. And then, you have to stitch uh, your eyes and the, the nose. You can use, for example, a black yarn and you can do this with a wool needle doesn't matter uh, where you put this you have only to do some some spots for for the eyes and the triangle for the nose and then you're done and you have a nice bunny